Welcome back, beautiful peeps, wherever place you're watching this amazing show. This is the baddest, the illest, the legendary show in the 254. And in case you're just joining us, this is Grapevine, baby. <laughs> All right, right about now, let's have a chit chat with the Miss Beauty of Africa International pageant. I told you this is the only place that you get to meet these queens, you know, the real queen. And seated next to me is the real queen. She is Miss Beauty of Africa International pageant. Hey, Cindy is Cindy. <laughs> Did I mention your name right? No, not right. <laughs> so you're Cindy? It's Cindy. It's Cindy. Yeah. I'm telling you this lady, hey, she's double B, manze. She's beautiful and she got brains. Eh? You are an Thank accountant, you. yeah? Yes. From the Jomo Kenyatta University of Kenya. Yes. And KC, uh, KCA University. Yeah. yeah. Man, do tell me about your education life. So, uh, as you've heard, I'm Cindy Cindy and I'm yeah. a professional accountant. Mm -hmm. So, I had my bachelor's degree in Jomo Kenyatta University mm -hmm. and for four years. And as well as that, I was doing my CPA examinations mm -hmm. in KCA University. Yeah. Because with accounting, you have to do a degree and also a professional examination. Wow. Yeah. So, Cindy, when did you come to Nairobi? Okay, I came to Nairobi in 2014 mm. for my university, but all my life I've been living in Western Kenya, a place mm. called Kakamega. Mm. Have you heard of it? Of course, man. <laughs> yeah, I'm from the Western Kenya. Kenya. Yeah. Yeah, uh -huh. that's where I grew up. Mm -hmm. But in 2014, I came for my university in Nairobi. Wow. Yeah. So afterward, that is when now you started your modeling career. Yes. Wow. Exactly. What was the experience? Take me through your modeling career. I can't say it's very smooth. It's a very, very tough experience mm -hmm. to become a model. Mm -hmm. And I started modeling in 2015, mm -hmm. and my first show was a bridal show. Yeah. I just thought, because they had called for auditions, mm -hmm. and I thought, I've been always wanting to try this. Why not? Yeah. So I gathered my courage. It's not easy. And mm -hmm. uh, the room is so full of people, like 300 ladies come to audition, mm -hmm. and probably they just need 10. So you just go there for luck for the first time. Mm -hmm. But then um, I was shortlisted and from that I thought, yes, I can do this. That's when I continued and took modeling. All right. So let's talk about Miss Beauty of Africa mm -hmm. International Pageant. I mean, what was your emotional rush when, oh you, my were, God. when you were mentioned as the Miss? That was like the best day in my life. Mm -hmm. It's actually because we had so many remarkable ladies yeah. around African countries. Mm -hmm. We both went to Nigeria wow. and it was such a nice experience having uh, stayed with them for two weeks in a boot camp. Mm -hmm. I was just like any lady here can win, but the experience that we get from here is just the most amazing experience. Mm -hmm. So I was called the winner and it was just like a dream come true. I didn't believe it. <laughs> wow. Yeah. Man, I'm telling you she's the real queen right here. She's talking effortlessly with a smile. Eh? <laughs> hey. Okay, for the people who are, you know, uh, getting to know this Miss, uh, Miss Beauty of Africa International pageant, it is the third it is the third pageantry after, you know, Miss World and Miss Universe, right? Yeah. Yeah. And also, there is this title that you won, yeah. BAIP. IP. Yeah. Do tell us about it. Yeah, BAIP is actually Beauty of Africa International Pageant. Mm -hmm. And it's a pageant that is held in Nigeria. It started in 2010. Yeah. And it basically main advocacy is to unite Africans mm -hmm. to use every ambassador in their own countries to unite and to, to use their charm and to unite Africa to become as one nation mm -hmm. and as well as us to learn cultures from different places because Africa is a very diverse continent and sometimes without this we cannot know what happens to other African countries wow. but Beauty of Africa brought us together from every African country mm -hmm. to get to know and learn about more cultures. Wow. Yeah. As we speak right now you're supposed to represent Kenya internationally. Yeah. yeah. That is next year. Yeah, next year. Uh, what is this uh, competition about? It's called Miss International. It's actually what you were talking about, the third, is, the third biggest pageant mm. in the world. Yeah. Yeah, so it's a very, very big pageant. And next year is the 60th anniversary of Miss International. Mm. And it's such an honor to represent Miss Inter Kenya in Miss International in the 60th anniversary. Mm. So it's held in Tokyo, Japan. Wow. Yeah. 
Man, I can't believe this. <laughs> I can't even believe that we are just seated, you know. We, we are now chilling, you know, vibing with you right here. The real queen. Eh? <laughs> this is the only place that you get to meet all these queens, man. Yeah, right about now, we want to know a little bit about you. Okay. Yeah. yeah. What is this thing that people don't know about you? Uh, I think I love exercising so much and mm. I am a very early riser. Yeah. Mostly by 5 a.m. I am awake to run around. Mm -hmm. I think I hope people don't see me like a witch, witch doctor <laughs> because, yeah, I run of very course, much. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Amazing. So this beautiful body does not just come by, you know, sleeping and waking up without exercising. Yeah, I love <laughs> running and I feel like it yeah. makes you happy. It um, puts up your mood and helps you in the mind as well as the body. Absolutely. Yeah, yeah. so what's your favorite color? I love red. Half mm -hmm. of my closets, half of my dresses are red. Mm -hmm. so red is just the color to be for me. Are you a watch person? Yeah. Uh -huh. Unfortunately today I don't have my watch, but I walk with my watch everywhere I go. Wow. <laughs> so yeah. what is this one thing that you cannot leave your house without? I think my phone. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because of the current trending world right now, mm. I can't leave my house without my phone. Wow. Yeah. So between high heels and uh, sports shoes? I love heels. Wow. It brings the elegance and the charm in a woman. Uh -huh. and I just love it. Between trousers and dresses? I love dresses as well. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right. We're just trying, you know, this... Uh, you know, this question so that you yes. can know you are a queen, you know. Yeah, thank yeah. You. Of course. Now, uh, people tend to assume that, you know, when you're at the top there, you don't experience, you know, some of the challenges. Yeah. yeah. But challenges are everywhere. Exactly. Yeah. What are some of the challenges that you faced during, you know, representing Kenya, you know, up and down? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so I think the biggest challenge I've found mm -hmm. uh, Kenya we are not well conversant with the beauty pageantry industry mm -hmm. and we have so many myths about beauty pageantry and try to, trying to make people understand yeah. about what it is and everything that it entails can yeah. be quite hard because uh, beauty pageantry is actually uh, more about modeling. Yeah. It's basically being a brand ambassador and trying to change the world or change a change an aspect to be better in the world. Yeah. Yeah. So making mm -hmm. people understand it is mm -hmm. very, very difficult. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, as we wind up right now, yeah, uh, there have been, you know, cases of, you know, uh, teenagers getting uh, pregnant yeah. and it is rampant right now. As a miss, you know, for people, for young girls who are just, you know, watching this show mm -hmm. and admiring you, yeah. what is your message to them? I would like to tell them that there is time for everything. Mm -hmm. A youthful age or teenage age is just a time that passes and it basically builds your whole life in the future. If you're not going to use it well, maybe you won't have a very, uh, the life that you want in the future. So I would like to tell them that there is time for everything. Mm -hmm. Just be happy and study because it really, really helps. Wow. Thank you so much. <laughs> Guys, man, this is Cindy. Is Cindy. Make sure you go out there and, you know, support her. You can even follow her, you know, in all yeah. the social media platforms. Thank you so much, Miss. Eh? Thank you so this much, is an honor. Jack. I really appreciate it. It's an honor to be here with you today. All right. Too.